Well, today we're just going to add some detail to the TARDIS from the Warlord Games 13th Doctor and TARDIS set. So in the last video I painted the Doctor. So we're just going to add a bit of detail to this. It doesn't need much. It comes in a quite a nice sort of matte blue finish. So we're just going to add some detail and some weather into that. I'm going to start by painting the police public call box sign in in black. I'm just going to use the bad and black for that. I'm just going to paint the door sign in in black. Gonna paint the windows in in pure white and then the window frames in a sort of light grey just to show a difference. So I'll do the other four sides like that and the good thing is because it's coloured resin uh, if you slop over a little bit you can just scrape it off using a knife. So I'll paint that and we'll come back. Right well I've painted all the windows in. I've done some edging in blue just to, to define it and then I'm going to do the, uh, the panel lines in light grey so I'm just going to mix some white with some Dawnstone and make it quite thin so that it flows quite nicely. There we go, and I'll do that on all the windows. Um, I'm also going to do some white highlighting of the sign. Yeah, I'm just going to use white for the very tip. And what I'm doing is picking out the letters. Oops, so police so I'll pick out the rest of those and then I'm also going to do some dry brushing of this sign in white which may or may not work so let's have a look just to sort of bring out the lettering yeah I think that works there's no way I could paint these letters on there there we go, I wonder if that would work on here as well. It would. So you've got two choices on that. You can either just dry brush white onto it or paint it on like I did. So I'm going to do that on all the other sides and then we'll come back. Okay, so I've uh, painted all the window frames and I've painted the lettering on. Um, so all I'm going to do now is using, I've got some black wash. I'm just going to run that into the edges of the door frames. I'm also going to run it down the insides of the pillars. Pretty much anywhere there's a corner or a groove. I guess I'll do that all over. 
Okay, so I've run some flesh wash as well around the window frames just to dirty it down a bit and then like I say done some black wash in the panels just to weather it a bit uh, and then once that's dry we can dry brush it a little bit bring up some detail but I'm going to do the gold parts now and for that I'm going to use Balthazar gold because that's quite a nice gold to cover with That's pretty much dry. I'm just going to dry brush it in very lightly with some white just to bring up a bit of detail. And then all I'm going to do now is give it a coat of matte varnish all over and then we'll come back and see what it looks like. There we go, so I've dry brushed over it and I think it's come out quite well. So you've got the Doctor and the TARDIS. Um, I think it's a really nice TARDIS model. It does lean a little bit when you look at it that way, but straight on, it's pretty spot on. I think those make a really nice set. You could use the TARDIS, you could fill in the, the grooves if you want to use the TARDIS for any other Doctor, but I think uh, they do make a different version of TARDIS, and I think they do one now with the doors open, which sounds quite interesting, so I might try and get one of them. Um, but uh, thank you for watching, and um, please like and subscribe if you want to see more of the uh, figure painting. Um, and thanks for watching, and I'll see you again next time. Thanks, then. Bye.